penalty score 12.8. That's what's made the difference. Presenting Wales, Elizabeth Popova. Second gymnast in this all-around final to represent Wales, the youngest competitor, just 15 years of age. Elizabeth Popova scored 23.4 in qualification. <laughs> Excellent on the pirouettes, clean on the catch. Another powerful gymnast, very good on the leaps. Beautifully timed. There, she had to move back a little to catch, but it was very effective. For me, a lot better than her opening routine. I think quite a lot of the gymnasts, a hoop is the first piece, they competed and they were almost a overawed with the audience and the whole arena yesterday. Well, if you think what most normal 15-year-olds are doing on a Friday, it's not competing at the Commonwealth Games, is it, Christine? And you sometimes forget the stage and the centre of pressure. I mean, this is a packed arena. Representing your country is a big thing, but for me, that was a much more confident performance to the point of she looked like she enjoyed it a lot more than yesterday. And then they have the opportunity to be a lot more expressive. Well, I think the opening day of competition is always quite nerve wracking for gymnasts because it's the qualification for everything else. So if you don't work well that first day, your championships is over. Uh, plus the added Thing, that it was the team competition and you don't want to let your teammates down. You can see the hoop almost hovering in the air then. Yeah, some fabulous work. There you go, the gymnast. That's the one where she just had to step back a little bit to get under the hoop. But I mean, you're talking minor and it looks better than yesterday. Yeah. It is 26.4. Three marks improvement. She had 12-1 in qualification. Representing Wales, Elizabeth Popova. Loads of support for the Welsh team. Elizabeth Popova. Eighth with the ball in qualification. So it's a ball final. So capable of a great routine. Impressive start. Great change of tempo.
super finish and a real expressive performance there. Well, they love that, so did we. What fantastic potential this young gymnast has. And another gymnast in this competition, Christine, that's coached by her mother, Iona. And they've got an amazing relationship. So they tell me. Good extension. I'm impressed for a young gymnast, really quite mature bodywork and expressiveness. Yeah, as I said before, a real hope for the future. Wales have had some great results in rhythmic gymnastics over the past Commonwealth Games. And I think uh, this is certainly one to watch for the future. That was the small error. Two steps to catch it up. So there will be some deductions. But again, some really intricate work with this piece of apparatus. And again, as we've said, not the easiest to control. Certainly if it drops on the floor, you have to be sharp. And a nice little run out for the ball final, which is in tomorrow. Just make these few little tweaks. Score comes in, 26.6. Let's win to fourth place. Popova. For Wales, Elizabeth Popova. Fourth highest score with the club's Christine. We'll see her in the final tomorrow. Can she improve on 27.7? She's another strong, determined gymnast. Very good on the pirouettes. Transfers from one shape to the other very well indeed. Selling the routine. Working very nicely with the music. A little slip. But perfect timing at the finish, and that really, she just let the uh, club slide out of her fingers. She'll be wanting to make sure she puts that right for tomorrow when she's in the finals of the clubs. Yep. For sure, and again, another gymnast that's really impressed. There's a huge talent for Wales. Wales gymnastics have had a great tradition in rhythmic gymnastics over the Commonwealth Games. And you're right, Christine. She'll be wanting to put that right tomorrow because a real medal chance. Well, I do think that the Welsh supporters probably win the prize at this, at the rhythmic gymnastics. Certainly, we've had more noise from Welsh supporters than from anyone. Yep, they certainly have been very vocal. But these uh, gymnasts have given them plenty to shout about. All the home nations in this rhythmic competition have been fantastic. 25.5.
One and two, Australia, Canada, and uh, third place, Canada. So it's Australia and two Canadians at the moment. For Wales, Elizabeth Popova. Another gymnast with great extension through the ankles and legs. Very nice pirouette. Good execution of the illusion turns. So pleased she finished with that performance, Christine. It really did showcase her rhythmic gymnastics. Yeah, it's been a little bit up and down on the other apparatus, but that was great. Yeah, it was such a sparkling performance. Such a difficult combination there. Three leap jumps, then to complete in enough time to catch the stick. And the ribbon to keep the movement going. Yeah, I think that's her best performance today, Christine. I know scores are traditionally lower on the ribbon, but uh, yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed that. Well done. She certainly looked a lot happier throughout that performance as well, Christine, don't you? If things are going well, it, it does transpire into the routine. It certainly does. And she is a young gymnast who's not always able to uh, cover the emotion. But rhythmic gymnastics is an emotional performance. You have to give of yourself to the performance. And so if it's not going right, you are likely to let that be seen as well. That was a great retrieval there, actually. Three rotations. Yeah, what a finish. It was, she was delighted. And they're still shouting for Wales in the audience. 24.25 improvement on qualification. Yes.